This is going to be a video tutorial on how to create a hidden folder on your desktop using Windows 11. Let me uh, jump over to my desktop here. I am on my desktop now. To create a hidden folder on your desktop, I actually have a folder right here. It is invisible. There is no name to it. But if I put my mouse cursor over it, that's the only way you could tell it's there, to roll your mouse cursor over it. If I double click on it, it opens like a normal folder would open. To create a hidden folder like this, I'm going to move this one out of the way. I'm going to create a folder on my desktop. You can do this with an existing folder, but I'm going to, for the sake of this video, I'm going to create one. I'm going to right click. I'm going to go down to New and straight across to Folder. There is my new folder. Now the first thing I want to do is get rid of this name here. And the way to do that, there's different ways you can do it. I'm going to open Character Map on my computer. What I want to do is just get an empty character from Character Map. I'm going to go down to the bottom down here, down to the search bar, I'll put my mouse cursor in there, and I'm going to type in Character Map. And right here, this character map. I'm going to click on it. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this little scroll wheel down here, this little bar here, and I'm going to scroll down about three-fourths of the way to where you see these empty characters here. I'm going to select one of them. Don't matter which one you select. I'm going to select this one here. I'm going to go down to the bottom and click on select. And then I'm going to click on copy to copy it to my clipboard. Now I'm going to close character map. I'm going to go back to my folder. I'm going to right click on it. And then right up here at the top, I'm going to click on rename. This icon right up here, rename. And I'm going to press control V on my keyboard to paste in that empty character. Control V. Then I'm going to hit enter. Now my folder has no name. Now to remove the icon, that's also very easy to do. I'm going to right click on the folder again. I'm going to go down to where it says properties and click on properties. Now in this dialog box that opens up here, you have uh, tabs across the top here. I'm going to click on customize. Then I'm going to go down toward the bottom of the dialog box in the folder icons section. I'm going to click on change icon. Now another little dialog box opens up. You could use any one of these uh, icons here for your folder icon, but I want to use an empty icon. I'm going to grab this little scroll bar down here and I'm going to scroll over just a little ways to where I see these empty icons here. I'm going to select one of them. I'm going to select this one here. Then I'm going to go down to the bottom and click on OK. Then on the original dialog box, I'm going to click on Apply. And then I'm going to click on OK. Now as you can see, my uh, folder has disappeared. It, it's still there. If I highlight over it, it's still there. And if I double click on it, it opens like a normal folder, but it is not visible. The folder itself is not visible, but it's still there. That is how to create a hidden folder on your desktop in Windows 11. Thanks for watching.